All righty, Craig, thank you very much. Your full weather forecast brought to you by Scott's Recreation, New England's largest trailer dealer, home of Maine's lowest camper and tractor prices, with locations in Turner, Manchester, Herman, and Orono, Maine. All righty, wave height's a little bit active out there this morning at around four feet, according to the buoys right nearby. Despite that, though, we have no advisories in effect along the coast or on land, at least at this time. Now, we do have some areas of dense fog that have been developing out there this morning from near Bar Harbor to Waterville, Augusta, just in a few spots, so very hit and miss with regards to the fog this morning. So, my encounter just a little bit of that as you move forward. That will be fizzling out throughout the day. Now, we have been watching for a few rain showers that have been passing through last night and parts of this morning. Notice though, the clouds for the most part, the thicker clouds are getting out of here. We may have some more clouds still this morning and maybe a few sprinkles or light rain showers, but we will be transitioning to a partly cloudy sky moving forward. This system here is going to stay to our south as it tracks off towards the east. Our next system later on this week that we'll have to watch out for is actually near parts of Colorado for the time being, so it doesn't look like too much just yet, but later on this week, that'll start to move in our direction. Future cast moving forward for today, we have clouds, maybe some morning fog, a few light rain showers or sprinkles. We get that out of here during the afternoon period, becoming partly cloudy. Notice though, a few clouds moving in later on tonight, maybe some areas of dense fog. As we head towards tomorrow, a lot of sunshine, maybe a few passing clouds during the afternoon period, and then again by Tuesday night, maybe a few passing clouds, and it looks to be about it there. But meanwhile, those we talk about the gusty winds. Not much of anything to say with the winds. Maybe a few gusts up to 50 miles per hour further down to the south. Most of the wind will stay off to the north for today and maybe a little bit for tonight. But for tomorrow, most of us will get on the gusty winds again. That could reach up to 20 to even 25 miles per hour at times. Average high temperature is 63 degrees. We'll be mid 60s today. Lower 70s for a Tuesday. Lower 60s Wednesday. Upper 50s for a Thursday. Middle 50s Friday. Upper 50s Saturday. And we're back in the lower 60s again as we head towards your Sunday. Your forecast coming up for today. Middle 60s, partly cloudy overall. Some morning sprinkles or light rain showers. And that south wind getting up to around 5 to 10 miles per hour at times. By tonight, lower 40s, partly cloudy with a light and variable wind. As we head towards tomorrow, lower 70s, partly cloudy and breezy. Northwest wind getting up to around 25 miles per hour at times. Let's check out your extended forecast brought to you by Scott's Recreation. Rain showers on Wednesday with highs in the low 60s. A small chance for rain showers Thursday, otherwise mostly cloudy. Highs in the upper 50s. Middle 50s Friday with a chance for rain showers.